Hello and welcome back. In this video, I will share with you a sample question and answer of emerging technology on chapter 3, which means on artificial intelligence, uh, part 2. If you are new here and need to learn uh, or get technology related video, subscribe to this YouTube channel or let me show too. And let's get started to our today's video, which is sample question and answer of emerging technology on uh, chapter 3. <laughs> Number one, define the word artificial and the word intelligence. Artificial means man made, and intelligence means thinking power or ability to learn and solve problems as human is intelligence. Artificial means man made, and intelligence means power of thinking or ability to learn and solve problems. Question number two What is artificial intelligence? Artificial intelligence is a branch of computer science that is used to create uh, a machine which can behave like human, think like human, and able to make decisions like human, or simply you can define artificial intelligence as man-made thinking power, or a machine which can think as human beings called uh, artificial intelligence. Question number three, what artificial intelligence is composed of? So these are components of artificial intelligence, those are learning, reasoning, problem solving, perception and linguistic uh, intelligence are the components of artificial intelligence. Question number four, which assessment is used to test the intelligence of machine or uh, system? So the intelligence of machine or system is measured or assessed by using a Turing test. Question number five, what is the Turing test? Turing machine is a method for uh, testing the machine ability. Machine ability, and to say one machine is intelligent, it should pass uh, Turing test. Question number six: What is the difference between artificial intelligence, machine learning, deep learning? Artificial intelligence is about making intelligent machines or creating intelligent machines. Machine learning is a subset of artificial intelligence that help uh, to build artificial intelligence. And uh, we have also deep learning. Deep learning is a subset of machine learning that uses a large amount of data and a complex algorithm to uh, train a model. Question number seven. Why we need artificial intelligence? We need artificial intelligence for the following purpose. To create express system that can learn, demonstrate, explain and advise and uh, to create a machine which finds solution to complex problems like human do. So for this reason we need artificial intelligence. Question number eight, what do you think uh, the main goal of the advancement in artificial intelligence? The main goal of artificial intelligence include replicating human intelligence, solving knowledge intensive tasks, creating some expert system are what some of the main goal of uh, artificial intelligence. Question number nine, list at least four advantage of artificial intelligence. So there are uh, so many uh, advantages of artificial intelligence. Some of them are uh, high accuracy with few error, high speed, high reliability, useful for risky areas, digital assistance, useful as public utility are some of uh, the advantages of artificial intelligence. Question number 10, write down some disadvantage of artificial intelligence. Some of the disadvantages of artificial intelligence include high cost. Artificial intelligence can't think out of the box. Artificial intelligence have no feeling and emotion, which means current artificial intelligence have no feeling and emotion. Increased dependency on machine, uh, no original creativity, unemployment or making a person jobless, and make man lazy are some of the disadvantages of artificial intelligence. Uh, question number 11. Uh, do you think artificial intelligence is old technology? If your answer is yes, why? 
can you name the person who coined the term artificial intelligence first and uh, when the artificial intelligence is coined? The answer is yes, because artificial intelligence is not new technology. It is a uh, technology which is uh, introduced in 1943 or around 1950s by uh, the person or the scientist called Marvin Min Sky. So uh, artificial intelligence is not a new uh, idea or it is not new technology. It is old technology. Question number 12. How many levels of artificial intelligence is there listed? So there are several levels of artificial intelligence in which the first one is a rule-based system, the second one is context awareness and retention, the third one is domain-specific expertise, the fourth one is reasoning uh, system, the fourth one is self-aware system or artificial general intelligence system, the sixth one is artificial superintelligence, and the seventh one is singularity and transience. So these seven things are seven levels of artificial intelligence. Question number 13. What is the feature of artificial intelligence? Artificial intelligence has affected many women and almost every industry and it is expected to continue to do so. So artificial intelligence is going to impact the world more than anything in the history of mankind. Question number 14. What is the difference between strong artificial intelligence and weak artificial intelligence? Weak artificial intelligence are the machine that cannot perform tasks independently uh, and instead it depends heavily on human interferences. Uh, and when it comes to strong artificial intelligence, strong artificial intelligence machine can think and perform tasks as their own as human do. Strong artificial intelligence has complex algorithms that help it act in various situations, whereas weak artificial intelligence are pre-programmed by humans. So this is the difference between weak and uh, strong artificial intelligence. Question number 15. What are different platforms for artificial intelligence development? Some software platforms for artificial intelligence development are Amazon Artificial Intelligence Service, TensorFlow, uh, Google Artificial Intelligence Service, Microsoft Azure Artificial Intelligence Platforms, and so on are some of the platforms used for the development of artificial intelligence. Question number 16. What are the types of artificial intelligence? Artificial intelligence can be classified into uh, different categories based on capability and the functionality. Based on capability, artificial intelligence can be uh, classified into narrow artificial intelligence, general artificial intelligence, and super artificial intelligence. And based on functionality, artificial intelligence can be classified into reactive machine, limited memory, self-awareness, and the theory of mind artificial intelligence. So these are the types of artificial intelligence based on capability and based on functionality. Question number 17. Is it possible to map the way of human thinking to artificial intelligence component? If your answer is yes, why? The answer is yes, which means it is possible to map human thinking to computer or it is possible to map human thinking stage to the layers and the component of artificial intelligence system. Question number 18. List down some influential factors that accelerate the rise of artificial intelligence. So the following are the influencer of artificial intelligence, big data, advancement of computer uh, processing speed and a new chip architecture, cloud computing and application programming interface, the emergence of data science are some of the area which uh, influences artificial intelligence or which take off artificial intelligence to the next level. Question number 19, what is the cloud and uh, what do you think about cloud computing? When you come to cloud, cloud means or cloud refers to the server that are accessed over the internet. Uh, any software and database that run on the server is called cloud. Whereas cloud computing is a delivery of computing service, including server, storage, database, networking, software analytics, and intelligence over uh, the internet or over the cloud to offer faster innovation, flexible resources, and uh, economies of uh, the scale. So this is a difference between cloud and the cloud computing. Question number 20. Why big data influence the rise of artificial intelligence? The larger amount of data uh, that artificial intelligence system can access, the more machine can uh, learn and therefore more accurate and efficient their uh, result will be, which means uh, to make smart uh, object or to make smart machine or to make intelligent machine, we should have to have what? Data. So data is a backbone for artificial intelligence. That's why uh, big data influences the rise of artificial intelligence.
question number 21 is face recognition artificial intelligence or example of artificial intelligence why the answer is yes which means face recognition is one of the best example of artificial intelligence question number 22 what are some application of artificial intelligence in agriculture so the following are some of the application of uh, artificial intelligence in agriculture Question number 23. What are some real life applications of artificial intelligence? So here are some of uh, the application area uh, of artificial intelligence like autonomous transportation, like self-driving car, drone, education system powered by artificial intelligence, healthy care, uh, space exploration, entertainment. Question number 24. What is chat? Chatbot is artificial intelligence software or agent that can simulate a conversation with women uh, using natural language processing. The conversation of uh, this chatbot with women can be uh, achieved through application or website or uh, messaging application. Question number 25. List down some concrete example of artificial intelligence in mobile uh, phone usages. So these are some of the application area of artificial intelligence uh, in mobile usage. By using mobile phone, we can map and navigate the resource of actual uh, detection and recognition in mobile phone. There is text editor or autocorrect or grammar checker. There is search and recommendation algorithms. Digital assistant, which means there are so many uh, digital assistants like Siri uh, and uh, uh, Google Assistant. It can be also used in social media and uh, in electronic payments. So these are some of uh, the application of artificial intelligence in mobile usage. Question number 26, list down some concrete example of artificial intelligence in healthy care. So these are some of the application of artificial intelligence in healthy care. Question number 27, what is the difference between robot and artificial intelligence? Uh, the answer is uh, robotics and artificial intelligence are two related, uh, but they are uh, entirely different fields or different things. Robotics involves the creation of robot to perform tasks without uh, further in in intervention, while artificial intelligence is how system emulate the human mind to make decision and learn. So artificial intelligence is able to learn as a human being, whereas uh, robotics is programmed to do uh, something which cannot learn as artificial intelligence. So this is a difference between robotics and artificial intelligence. This is all about chapter 3, part 2, uh, artificial intelligence, sample question and answer. Thank you for watching. For more video, uh, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to uh, Let Me Show too. See you in the next video. Bye bye.